most bizarre for her. And I want to wish Ripstar a happy birthday. God bless you. And I wish you a lot of love, presence, good health. And may you be a long friend of me. A good friend. I'll always think of. I can tell you about my beautiful hobby. And my hobby is karate. What a little karate. My favorite kicks and punches. How about the Yura Mawashigiri do kick? The Maigiri. The punch. The hammer punch, the shooter, the defense, and the attack with the hand. But remember, don't punch too hard when the training, because knowing the balance, using the good strength. Not to hurt your opponent at the training. Because it's your partner, your sparing partner you train with. And the kihon, the basics of karate. Different moves, defense and attack. You block, you punch, you block, you kick. Also, do the high kick. When you make a movement, you can make the kick like you really want to kick, but you don't kick. That's just to trick someone with a fake punch or a fake kick. Before karate, I did kung fu for two years. Yeah, two years kung fu. And karate is just a little bit different. Most uh, of karate, I like the sparring when you use when I can use the movements I learned at the training and use it at the sparring moment. I can tell you enjoy the stress out when the things on my mind. I can clear out my mind. When doing karate at the sparring with the partner, there are a lot of kumites. Like the ippon kumite, is the one step block and punch. Because it's about you already know the 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 partner is going to punch you, to punch you at the head, the belly, and doing the maigiri, the kick. So. This is just uh, the Ippon Kumite is for the white belt and the when you have the yellow belt you have also know the Ippon Kumite and the Sambon Kumite. Sambon Kumite is actually the repeating of the Ippon Kumite but in three steps. Ippon Kumite is one step defense block and punch or defense kick block kick but the Sambo Kimete is three time punches, three time belly punches, and three time kicks with the Maigiri. And I can tell you, I really love if this sport. Love it because I can create up my mind and find the balance through the sport. And I'll post some videos and pictures of what I do at this sport. Because I really love it. And I think this is something I really like. 
I invest a lot of time. So if you know, talk about it. Four times a week karate. So I think about private lessons. So I can train five times a week. So I uh, can do uh, the competition. And you never be old. As long as you never give up. I can tell you. This is something I want in life. And not just working, working, working. As of dreams. I want to follow my dreams, you know. Never give up. There are a lot of things I want to do. And it's just something. I want to follow my dream. One of my dreams. When it comes true, I'm gonna look back. Look back. What I reached. The goals that I reached, you know. And when I look back, I'm more than satisfied. And I want to let everybody know that I'm gonna be someone that never gives up. And I wish you, wish you all the best, the best in life because. You deserve it. When you don't give up and you reach your goal, you deserve it. Because you reach the goal. And the rewards of reaching the goal is more than satisfying. Because when you set up a goal and you reach your goal, you set up bigger goals in life. And you reach more than you have ever expected. And patience, patience, you need patience. Don't think about something big, something big that's gonna be happen that you can reach it in one second. In this time, be patient and trust in yourself. Because when you trust in yourself, you give yourself power, a power that comes from the inside, that stimulates you to be big, big at thinking, but also big at doing the stuff to reach your goal, doing the things because you know that you can motivate motivate yourself be the best trust yourself be patient need your time invest the time to reach your goal and you know you're gonna go for never gonna be old as an example of me starting at my old age on the karate almost a year you know for doing karate nine months but I'm not afraid I know I um, want to uh, participate in a match of karate I want to try I want to know I want to know you let you know that I'm not gonna give up I know I'm gonna be I'm gonna succeed if it's sport it's not just a hobby, you know, it's an example of not never give up, not giving up. And yeah, this goes the same for you, my friend, my brothers and sisters. I don't know how you see me, but I can tell you, I wish you all luck, you know, in life, the best. And that's something, when you succeed, be happy. Be happy in everything. Reach your small goals. Set up bigger goals. And listen to my words. Everything's gonna be alright. Yes.